the LS130 frame I reviewed a while back. And this thing actually measured out between 145 and 148, somewhere in there. And I went ahead and I ordered another LS130 frame. Now why, I don't know, but here it is. And I noticed something, how the frame looked a little different than the original 130 frame that I uh, received the first time. So let me get this taken out of the package and we'll put it together. Oh, look at that, look how fast that was. Okay, just kidding, I actually have two of them. <laughs> but look at these, these are both the 130. This was the one I originally ordered, this is the one I just received today actually. And you can see here the arms are a little bit uh, closer together front to back. And also the angle between the two arms changed. These are a little bit more angled out and the ones on the right on the new one are a little bit more straight out. Now the top plates are actually the same, so no change there. But uh, I was thinking I might end up taking these legs off and putting them up here on the top, taking the legs off this one and using them for the other two here and have this be a little short top on it. Anyway, let's get this thing measured because it looked like it was going to be a lot shorter and look at this. If I get this ruler on here, get it lined up, there I got it about zeroed on this side and this side comes out to be about 135, 136 maybe. So this is actually really a LS130 frame. That's amazing because it's not a LS145 like this one was. So what's the weight difference between these? Let's find out. The original LS130 weighs in about 57 and a half grams. This new LS130 weighs in about almost, well, almost 56 grams. So the big difference between these two is really just the angle of these arms. It looks like they just kind of shorten them up a little bit to try to get it down closer to 130. The thickness of the, of the uh, plates didn't change at all and the size of the top plate didn't change. Well, let's get this sitting next to a deformation 130. And you can see how these actually look like they're the same size. And if you saw them, you'd probably say, oh yeah, they're pretty close. If I put the original 130 back in here, it looks like it's a little bit bigger than the 130. And you'd and I think it visually looks bigger. But this one looks about the right size. Anyway, looks like Lisa finally got some good rulers in and got their quadcopters fixed. Hopefully all the new ones that are sent out are actually this size instead of the 147 size. Anyway, this is just a little follow-up video to the previous one. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments section and I will try to answer them as best I can. And as always, thanks for watching.